What's up, my beautiful nieces and my handsome nephews? Welcome back to the Karmic Circus, where we expose all of these karmic -y ass clowns. Collective, please keep in mind that this reading may or may not resonate with your energy. So only take the parts that resonate with you and leave the rest for somebody else. If it don't fit, don't force it. Just relax. If you believe in love <laughs> and the promise that it brings, I want to love you for life. Because your life is why I live. Your love is why I live. Do you believe in love, divine feminine? Feminine energies? I know you do. See, you got men out here who don't believe in true love. But there is true love. When you find your divine masculine, that is your true love. Okay? But there's a divine masculine out here that has a karmic ex-wife, a karmic baby mama. Um, Right about now, she's mad because there was a breakup between her and this masculine. And this masculine don't have no regrets for breaking up with her. Because, see, whoever this karmic ex-wife is, she painted a negative picture of divine feeling. She been going around lying, manipulating people into believing that her lies are true. And all this person does is sit around on her lazy ass drink martinis and wine. But she about to get that ass tapped because right about now, the universe is stepping in and they getting information on this baby mama because she's doing some sort of witchcraft. And we're going to tap in and they're going to tap her ass while we tap in. So I'm asking everybody to hit that thumbs up button. Join the Soul Tribe on over here at the Karmic Circus. If you want to know about all these karmic ass clowns, you hit that thumbs up button. That's a way of purchasing a ticket. Okay. That's how you purchase your ticket because you can't get inside the circus without auntie. Yeah, I'm auntie. You can't get in the circus without that ticket. And you got to go and you got to sit in the in the audience with me. Because if, you, if you're caught... All out there in the parking lot, going out there to take you a cigarette break or whatever, you know. And Oscar catch you out there, you're liable to get thrown inside of the three ring circus. So make sure you hit that thumbs up button. So when Oscar comes up to you, you can show him that you subscribed and you hit that thumbs up button. And make sure you ring that notification bell, okay? Let me get my bell. Ring that bell. Don't forget to ring that notification bell. Okay? I woke my cat up. <laughs> she like, Mom, what are you doing ringing the bell? Did you know that bells uh, ward off evil spirits and shit? I didn't know. That's why the church have the bells. Okay, so this is, this is Wastebasket Wanda. Who's doing some witchcraft and painting a negative picture of divine feminine because divine masculine wants a two of cups with his divine feminine. And this is a lazy karmic. See, this is somebody who sits around. She don't do nothing for herself. She pays to get shit done. She runs this masculine's bank accounts low, these type of energies, you know. They they feel like they so beautiful, they so sexy that they don't have to work. They can get a man to take care of them and get their nails done, and get their wigs twisted and tightened up and shit. And, uh, what do they call it? Installed, all that bullshit. But this is a karmic ex-wife and she's lazy and she's probably a drunk. Okay. And she's getting drunk and doing some sort of witchcraft and the universe is watching that ass. Yep. So let's tap in. Tell me more about this ex-wife. What was the negative picture that she painted about Divine Feminine? Either this is the King of Pentacles in reverse. She could be saying that you don't have no money, you broke. Um, this masculine, she could be saying that this masculine is going broke being around you. Or she could be saying that 
this masculine is uh he's not you know she's basically she's lying because he's not going he's not spending money on her oh she's saying that the masculine is broke that motherfucker broke but he may not be broke he just not spending money on her or not giving her money so she's going around saying that he's broke yeah but she the one that's lazy out here she's the one that's sitting here drinking wine she's the fucking karmic energy who's an ex-wife or a baby mom yeah that's doing witchcraft that could be the witchcraft her running around lying that's evil eye manipulation that's witchcraft that's lying about something that's not true all of that shit is demonic okay tell me more what else is this karmic what is the, the negative picture virgo energy I'm so tired of seeing these damn herb signs coming out in there. I know that the person that I was dealing with is a uh, is a fucking hermit, and the the karmic feminine, the ex witch or the ex wife or the ex baby mama, whoever she is, she's she's a she's a either a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn, or she's a Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. Okay, yeah. So this is somebody's ex wife. That he went back to. So this is somebody he, he goes back and forth with. We have thank you bitches out here. You could be saying thank you bitches for the negative energy. The negative picture that you painted on me. And now the universe is stepping in. So they whooping their ass. Yeah. You didn't have to touch. You didn't have to touch touch them or touch her she's lying she's saying that you're lazy but she's the one lazy all these people that she lying to all they need to do is go to her house and go to your house divine feminine and see who is who this is somebody who probably you know she her house is just nasty she probably don't you know um uh, clean her refrigerator out she don't clean her stove off she don't mop her floors she you know she could even have a dishwasher and too fucking lazy to put the dishes in the dishwasher divine feminine me myself i don't have no dishwasher in my apartment i wish i did i was even gonna purchase me a little countertop you know a portable they do make them yeah look it up but this is this is a lazy person yeah and if you're feeling lazy, it could be your person being around this lazy witch. And she she could be trying to siphon his energy some sort of way. Or she could be talking about you so much to where she's so lazy, she's talking about you and having your, your name in her mouth, you know, all the time. To where it could be fucking with you, making you tired, Okay. She's projecting her energy. Everything that she's running around here saying about people is really her. And see, she's mad because this masculine, he he done, um, basically he done stopped fucking with her. So if this was his ex-wife or his baby mama, and he was always able to go back and forth to her, it the same story comes out. He stopped going back and forth because he met a real true divine feminine. So this is when they start doing the witchcraft, you know? Yeah. Because they didn't have a ten of cups. They wasn't they happily ever after. So they doing some sort of magic. You know, this ma this masculine, he's gained his strength. You know, that could be physically, mentally. He stopped waiting around this karmic energy. You know, he could have had you in the hangman position while he had while she had him in that position. Yeah. Tell me more. Yeah. He he's not he's not in his feelings behind this karmic. He's not feeling nostalgic about her. Six of Cups in reverse. 
and I was about to ask why. And then the Nine of Wands came out. Somebody that's um, impulsive and, and a hothead. Yeah. So he knows how she is. She's quick to lie. She's quick to manipulate. What else is she quick to do? <laughs> She's quick to ten of wands somebody, put burdens and stress on somebody, have them over obligated, burning them out. Yeah. She does that type of energy, but she's trying to project it off on somebody else. She done burnt this masculine off. Out. While she running around here painting a negative picture, saying some negative shit about divine feminine, she's lazy and she's a drunk. And now the universe is about to get that ass. What is the universe about to do? She about to have a tower moment. A tower moment that she tried to create for you is coming. Scorpio energy. Yeah, death. Tell me more. Universe, what are you about to do? What's about to happen to this planet? What is the tower? She's trying to suck the life out of out of a masculine. She sees that the masculine, for some of you, he could be a Leo, or he could be a Scorpio, or you could be a Scorpio or a Leo. But, you know, the universe is stepping in because this person, either there, she's talking about you and she's trying to, you know, use words against you to drain your energy or she's doing it to this masculine. And this is why the universe is stepping in because, you know, words she may be speaking may be trying to trap somebody, you know. Now she could be in jail. She could be in spiritual jail. She could be in an emotional jail. Um, she could be, you know, just feeling restricted, blinded, helpless and hopeless. Or she could be painting a picture and saying that that's you, but it's actually her. Because you're free. She's It's like she's keeping herself trapped in a, in a marriage. She's remembered she's an ex-wife. Okay, she may have a child with him and well, I'm his ex-wife, but I'm still his baby mama. That baby ain't going to, that baby um, is is only going to be the 18 years old and then it ain't no baby no more. Don't matter that he don't have to, he don't have to let you manipulate him using the baby. Because that's what they do. Tell me, you have a painful ending, ten of swords. Yeah. Yeah, she's trapped in the own in her own jail that she tried to create for you. And she looking at it. Queen of Pentacles again. Virgo Taurus Capricorn. Looking at a painful ending. She's looking at the what is the Ten of Swords? What is the Ten of Swords that this Queen of Pentacles is looking at? How she was how she created blocks in his masculine life. Um, how she's emotionally immature. And she's also looking at a positive change. Um, it isn't a pleasant surprise. She's mad. Okay. Yeah. She's mad at the fact that she's trying to create blockages. But she doubts that she can when it comes to a divine feminine. emperor so she's looking at this emperor she's looking at him like he ain't going by the rules or she could be looking at you divine feminine energy this could be how she looking, why she's saying you lazy. She may be saying you lazy, you, you a drunk when it's really her. She probably be slurring a lot when she talk. That's because she doing witchcraft. Clarify the witchcraft. Clarify the witchcraft. Damn, okay. She don't want something to end.
okay? Those fell out and flipped on the floor. She's doing witchcraft because she don't want it to end. It's already done. If you the ex-wife, you the ex-wife. So why don't she want it to end? Of a, uh, a king of wands. Why she don't want it to end? Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Scorpio out here. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. See, this masculine, he may be an entrepreneur. He may have his own business. He may sell something. Um, whatever it is he do, he makes good money with it. Okay. And this is this is uh the wastebasket Wanda, the codependent baby mama. See, all of this shit that she's saying, divine masculine or this masculine energy. He don't have to pay for Divine Feminine to get her wig installed. Either she know how to install it herself if she wears it, or she don't wear a and she don't wear a wig. She or she know how to do it herself. Either or. Um this is somebody who she's codependent. She won't even try to do nothing for herself. If she tries, she'll try one time and she'll fail. She'll give up. She's not somebody who have the strength to keep trying something. You know, this is somebody who possibly when they tried to ride a bike and because they fell off that one time, they never tried again. That type of energy. Yeah. Okay, so. I'm going to stop it right here. This reading gave you some clarification in your situation. Go on and hit that thumbs up button. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. Ring that notification bell. And I'll see you all in the next reading. If you're interested in a personal reading, all the information will be in the description box below this video. Peace out.